Hello everyone, in this video is very exciting because we will set up a domain name in our blog. So for now, it's axeltraveler.blogspot.com. We will turn this to axelmulat.com. So we'll purchase a domain name for our blog. So first step, let's go to godaddy.com. We will purchase a domain name through here. So if you finally decided what's your final domain name, just type in here. My final domain name is axelmulet.com. Just click search domain. Hopefully it's available. So good. It's available. So click continue to cart. So there are steps below guys, I don't need it. Step 1, step 2, just click continue to cart. In this page guys, there have uh, product terms. So you can choose your terms you want. You can choose 3 years, 5 years. For me, I need a 1 year only. Of course, after a 1 year term, I will re renew it again and pay it again. So it costs thirteen point seventeen dollars. So let's scroll down a bit. If you have a promo code, guys, just put your promo code here. If you wonder where to get a promo code, I create a video how to get a one dollar for a domain here in my YouTube channel. So for now, let's proceed to check out. If you new a uh, customer, guys, just click continue button and register. For me, I already registered, so I log in my account here. In this page, guys, there have a billing information. You can put your own bill information here. Just scroll down a bit. And I click save. In the payment information, guys, of course, we need a credit card, debit card, or prepaid card to purchase a domain. If you have a credit card, just put your information here. If you have a PayPal account, you can put your email PayPal account here. So in my case, I already add my card account. So in GoDaddy so after that if you finally choose what's your payment information just place your order just click oh don't forget to agree the terms and condition so check here and place your order so our payment are successful so the next step is manage domain so new tab as you see in this page, guys, there have a two domain name here, axelmulet.com. This is I newly purchased as of now, and we will set up this for our blog. So to set up this, let's go to this gear icon and click this, and click manage domain. So on this page guys be careful because this is the settings of your domain name so there have a uh, settings here and DNS zone file tab so to set up our domain in our blog let's go to this name C name alias so let's go to blogger.com and click settings and as you see publishing blog address set up a third party URL for your blog so click this and type your newly purchased domain name here www.axelmulat.com and save this will hit an error so don't worry we'll fix that so we need this to configuration guys just copy this copy go to domain details and edit this www and cname alias 
So www, go to this pen icon, edit this record. So remove this app symbol and replace the configuration ghs.google.com and click finish. So as you see the app symbol replace a ghs.google.com and we need another one. So click at record at the top of CNAME alias. So in AAAA configuration, just click add record. Let's change the record type. So CNAME alias and back to blogger.com and copy this guys. Copy, copy to the host field. Copy this again. Copy and paste to the point two field and click finish. So after that, you need to click this save changes link. So click save changes. So that's it. So as you see in the pop up screen here. We will take effect after 48 hours and don't forget to save the last thing. So save. So it successfully saved. And we need to config one more. Just edit this again. Click edit. And be sure you check this. If in case the user type in the browser axelmulat.com only, it will redirect to w.axel.com and save again. So as you see, www.axelmulat.com, this blogspot.com redirects to www.axelmulat.com. So we will wait until 48 hours so as you see in the axeltraveler.blogspot.com so it won't work now at this time we will wait after 48 hours so after 48 hours it will turn to axelmulat.com so see you in 48 hours guys so I'll be back hello guys I'm back after 48 hours so for now it's axeltraveler.blogspot.com so let's reload this page so now it turned to www.axelmulat.com actually guys it's not 48 hours it's a minute only actually I'm surprised I rest a minute only and I back and I hit reload and I'm surprised it turned to axelmulat.com in a little time. So let's continue this tutorial guys in part 29. If you have a question, just fill in the comment box section and I'll do my best to answer your question. And don't forget to subscribe my channel because there are lots of these tutorials to come. So see you in part 29. Goodbye.